Hi all, I am Sabu Joseph. Welcome to SVJ Academy. Today, I will show you how to update digital signature in income tax portal. When we are going to file income tax return or TDS return, we have to update the valid digital signature on the portal. Then only we can affix the signature on the utility and we can upload it. So when it is expired, we will apply for a new DSC and that DSC we have to update in all the portals, income tax, GST, TDS, EPF. So wherever we are using the utility, we have to update the signature with the new valid signature. We have to update the utility. So today we are going to see how to update the DSC in income tax portal. So let's see. This is the income tax portal www.incometaxindiaefiling.gov.in Here we can log in. On the income tax portal, we have two types of login. One is PAN based login and the second is PAN based login. The PAN based login is for filing income tax and all other forms returns relating to the income tax. But if it is login by PAN, we can file the TDS returns from 15G and 15H, we can file. So now I am going to update the DSC in the income tax portal by using PAN based login. So click on login. When we click on login, we can see the portal, login page, user ID and password. Here we have to give the user ID as our TAN number and the password of the TAN based login. For TAN based login, we have to create a username and password. That is also we can create through the income tax portal. Now I log in to the page using the TAN number and here we can see so many menus. Under profile, we can see a register digital signature certificate. So click on register digital signature certificate. For updating the signature, we have to generate the signature file. So for generating the signature file, the income tax department provided a utility, DSC utility, that we can download from here. So click on download, the utility downloaded, open it. It is a Java based utility. If your system is not supported with uh, Java, this utility could not be opened. So please download the Java version 32 bits, not 64 bits. If, even if your system is 64 bits, you have to download the Java version under 32 bit program. So open the DSC utility. Here we can see some options register or reset password using DSC upload XML, submit ITR or form online, bulk upload. These are the some files we have to sign by using this utility. Here we are we want, we want to update the signature. So register or reset password. Click on that one. Again here, enter e-filing user ID. Here our e-filing user ID is the TAN number, tax deduction account number. So provide the TAN number here and the next one is enter PAN of the DSC, the PAN number of the digital signature holder. So enter the PAN number, then click on the select the type of digital signature certificates. We are using the digital signature certificates under USB token. So select the USB token, that is the DSC holder name will be shown here. Then click on generate signature file. The file we can save in the desktop. Now the signature file is ready. Close the Java utility. Now go to the profile settings. Click on register digital signature certificates. Already we created the signature file. Choose the file here. It was placed on the desktop. Select the signature file. Then click on submit. Your digital signature certificate is successfully updated and the transaction ID so and so. We successfully updated the DSC on the income tax portal that we can use for future 
e filing of tds returns form 15g 15h etc already i have uploaded so many videos relating to how to file tds return online without going anywhere in facilitator center or any professionals from our office itself we can file the tds return that option is here for filing the tds return already i have uploaded two videos 24q and 26q how to upload the tds returns online kindly watch that video definitely you can file the tds returns every quarter without anybody's help if you are really like the video please like share to your friends relatives colleagues and uh, drop your comments on the comment box please subscribe my channel and uh, enable the bell icon you will get the real time notification so many videos are available in the playlist go and watch we can meet on next video till then bye